Hi, welcome. Today we will focus on learning about the supporting sentences in a paragraph. What is the purpose of supporting sentences? Supporting sentences develop and expand the main idea. These sentences tell you more about the main idea. Some are called major supporting sentences and others are minor supporting sentences. The major supporting sentences tell you more about the main idea sentence. While the minor supporting sentences tell you more details or explanations about the major sentences. Examine the major and minor supporting sentences in the following diagram. Example 1. Benefits of relaxation. Relaxation can help you cope with stress and anxiety. There are numerous relaxation techniques to choose from. These techniques can help you take your mind off daily activities and relax. For example, you can practice meditation, yoga, tai chi, breathing exercises, visualizations, or specific hobbies. An excellent method of relaxation is to listen to music by your favorite artists. During these activities, your mind takes a break from the busy lifestyle you lead. Conclusion As you change your focus and your thoughts, you banish stress and anxiety and you relax. Example 2. In store shoppers. Based on their attitudes and actions, in store shoppers can be categorized into easy to please, hard to please, or impossible to please customers. The first type of shopper, the easy to please shopper is well informed about the product description, knows what he or she wants and is a confident and happy shopper. Thus, after securing the product and determining that it meets their needs, the shopper makes the purchase. The second type of shopper, the hard to please shopper lacks confidence and is overwhelmed by choices and this leads to much indecision as this shopper hunts for the perfect buy. As a result, the shopping experience becomes a painful and tortuous chore that may lead to hasty purchases or hours of shopping time. The third type of shopper, the impossible to please shopper suffers from obsessive buying disorder and is a serial returner. Consequently, most products purchased are determined to be unsuitable because of the price, the fit, the quality or something else makes the product not right and 99% of the products are returned. Conclusion. Obviously every in-store shopper wants the best products and the best price, but shopping should be fun and not a trip to the dentist. So, what kind of in-store shopper are you? Follow these tips and you are sure to identify the major and minor supporting sentences in a reading. If you liked this video, then hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.